Another thing I wanted to show you in this Ford Escape while we had it here were these clips. Removing them and installing them. They can be kind of a pain. What these are, this is called considered hardware. And basically, I put the old one back on to show you how we're going to remove it. But as you can see, all it does is, is really create some spring pressure to hold that caliper, to kind of, kind of pull that caliper down so the caliper doesn't bounce around. Now, it does have the bushings that go through here that actually hold it to the bracket, but you don't want this caliper to move. So Ford designed this spring. Uh, Chrysler uses a version of it, uh, uh, Volkswagen uses a version of it, so, so they're out there. Sometimes it can be real bare to remove and to install. Now, like I said, I put the old one back on to show you how to remove it, then I'll show you the, how to put the new one on. And I'm sure there's more than one way to do this, but I'll show you the way I've been doing it. Now, I use a small screwdriver, again, make sure you've got your safety glasses on because these do pop off, and all you really have to do is get one corner of it off. Once you get the one corner off, then you just kind of lift it up here, unbolt it from there, and it's off. So this is not too bad. Never try to just spring it off because it will fly off and either hit you or somebody else in the shop. So this is the old one. Now we'll take the new one. Now this is, again, there's a lot of different ways to do this. This is the way I've been doing it for years. It seems to work pretty well. What you do is get one end started like that. So once you get the one end started, make sure this is pushed in. Now this one here, I actually install it in the hole there, and then usually just use my finger pressure here to push it down and in. So once it gets around there, but then take the other end of the screwdriver, a little hammer, make sure that those that hardware is all the way in the retaining hole. Now what that's doing is it's pushing on that, pulling the caliper down, keeps the caliper from rocking. Boy, it's solid as a rock. That's exactly what you want. You will get the new hardware uh, in, in, in most cases. If you don't, reuse the old one.